In today's video, we are taking a look at some of the recently released Blender add-ons and tools in addition to some updates of some of the already existing ones. First, we have a new interesting add-on called Baga IV Generator, which is a tool used to rapidly generate and create IV on different surfaces with a lot of control and in a short period of time. It comes with a preset library that contains over 120 presets of leaves and flowers in 30 different varieties of IV with parameters for each preset, which enables the generator to have the highest level of accuracy possible. Additionally, the generator creates by default an animated IV with a loopable animation. Furthermore, it is based on geometry nodes, so it will give you full control over the IV with a customizable generation for a large variety of vines and IV. And you can also control the leaves and flowers behavior. Moreover, it has a proxy system that you can use for better optimization, which is really great. This is a new add-on that comes with a kind of unique new feature that will help you if you want to document each step of your project. It is used to capture time-lapse footage of your project in the background. It allows you to capture screenshots and records the full project window at a fixed interval. Additionally, you can simultaneously record from the perspective of several cameras in the scene as well as cameras with animated keyframes. Furthermore, it allows you to automatically create a time-lapse video using the recorded images which is amazing. Now, talking about updates, we have ZenSets 2.0, which is the latest update. And if you don't know what ZenSets is, well, it is simply a tool that will help you create creative vertex groups in addition to face maps. It allows you to create ZenSets groups based on objects, and you can also manage and visualize them. So in the recent release, the developers behind this add-on have come up with some new and interesting features. Basically, they have changed the panel and UI design in order to make it easier to use. Additionally, they added a display feature where it will allow you to see which vertex belongs to the group when switching between different vertex groups. Moreover, you can now simultaneously import and export groups between different groups, which will be truly useful. And these are just some of the features that came with the recent update, because there is a lot more. So if you want to check the full update details, you will find the necessary links down below. Now, talking about simulations, this new add-on called Kaboom will help you with distraction simulations. It enables you to create VFX shots in a simple and easy way. It works by fracturing the model you want to destroy, and then you can animate the dynamics and adjust it until you get the crumbling and explosion effects that you want. Additionally, it provides many features and tools to make your animation look more real, such as a tool that creates convincing rough cuts to the flat faces, which also comes with a few settings that you can adjust in real time. Moreover, it allows you to quickly generate debris for the moving parts, which will add a lot of details to your simulation. In the end, you can quickly make smoke by just creating the smoke domain. After that, you can easily produce baked smoke by generated emitted particles. Also, everything can be customized, which is great. Talking about a new revolutionary add-on, there is a new one called Mesh Heal. This add-on allows you to restore your mesh objects, and it works by deleting the chosen faces and reassembling the lost pieces into its original form. It works on flat surfaces in addition to missing edges or corners. Furthermore, this add-on is very easy to work with and it will speed up your workflow especially if you are doing some hard surface modeling. Now we're gonna talk about the Space Elements add-on, which is a tool that allows you to create space scenes in Blender in a simple and very easy way. It has many cool features that you can use, such as an easy Space Galaxy background setup in addition to an easy lighting setup. Moreover, it provides you with five different realistic planets that are fully shaded and textured, in addition to five different assets such as satellites, shuttles, and ISS. Furthermore, it has an automatic composition with bloom in cycles. Overall, it is very easy to use and gives you full control over the planets where you can tweak some settings to get perfect results. Also, Polyfjord has officially released his first product, which is an asset pack that contains a lot of objects and rigs that will help you make mechanical creatures. The rig that he has released contains over 250 detailed parts that will allow you to create some stunning creatures. All the parts are properly scaled, so you don't have to worry about getting the correct scale to merge between the parts. 
Additionally, it includes 8 distinct animated rigs that you can play around with. Each rig has named bones and 250 or more frames of animation. Additionally, the majority of body movements is generated via procedural F-curve modifications, making the animation simple to adjust to your needs. Moreover, it has multiple customizable parts as well as photorealistic metal materials that will help you achieve the best looking model that you need. All the materials work with both EV and cycles, and they work on any model without the need for UV mapping. Also, the materials come with an easy shader controller to be able to customize them as much as you want. Talking about customization, we have an add-on called Next Street, which is an add-on that allows you to quickly create high-quality streets that you can customize as much as you want. It comes with a bunch of settings that you can tweak to help you create realistic-looking streets. It allows you to modify the width of the sidewalk and street. Additionally, you can add street lights and you can modify their intensity, scale, and color. In addition, you can select which light type you want to add and change, in addition to the ability to control the pacing between each light. Moreover, you can add some wetness to the street and sidewalks, and you can modify its height and scale. You can also add trees, bus stops, and services, as well as signs to the sidewalk, in addition to cars on the street. Furthermore, it allows you to add some walking characters. You can customize their speed, seed, and density. You can also add some imperfections, such as trash and leaves. Above all that, the add-on comes with some materials that you can add to the street and sidewalks and customize it as much as you want. We also have Eternal Sky Pro, which is an add-on that allows you to easily light your entire scene by adding a sky to it. It comes with a lot of parameters that allow you to customize and control every aspect of the atmosphere. Additionally, you can create a full cycle of night and day. For example, you can create a sunset or a sunrise as well as a daytime and a nighttime. It actually comes with high-quality Galaxy HDR eyes that allow you to create a beautiful space look and atmosphere. It also gives you the ability to create some beautifully looking clouds by either using highly customizable volumetric clouds or using procedural 2D clouds. If you are interested in one of these add-ons, you will find the necessary links in the description below. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can also check some of our previous videos. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.